This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Discoveries, Unit 6, Physical Computing, Lesson 2, Designing Screens with Code, Puzzle 7, Randomization. Moving, moving on the first click is fine, but this smiley would be even cooler if it moves somewhere, somewhere new every time we clicked. Fortunately, we can use the random number block to do that. If you don't have code down here, you need to go back and do the other lessons. Um, all right, do this. Instead of setting the X and Y property to a specific number, use the random number block to pick a new number, a new random X and Y each time the smiley is clicked. Okay. Tip, the Apple Lab screen is 320 wide, so that would be our X, by 450 tall. Got it. So that would be our Y. And notice uh, Y is kind of in the reverse. Zero Y is way up here. 450 is way up there. Random tip it. All right. So... For x, then, if we're going to randomize it, we can do 0 to 320. Granted, if it gets right at 320, it might be a bit off this screen, but let's try it. 0 to 450. All right. So, and again, we have this listener, and it's quote-unquote listening to Smiley, right? It has an ID of Smiley. Notice how this is screen? Smiley. Okay, computer, Smiley is, if it's clicked... It says, oh, okay, once it's clicked, i got to execute this function, and it will run that code. And then it listens again, so it will move more than once, because right now it's still listening. Oh, yeah, and again, and again, and it's just going to execute every time a particular event happens. If we wanted, we could keep them more on the screen by not letting it go to 450 and all that, but I am liking it. Cool. Let's uh, keep going.